Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Amy Ray of Amy Ray Plans. Today I'm here to film a plan with me for the week of December 23rd through December 29th, the week of Christmas. I am filming this a little bit early. I'm filming this Saturday the... Nope, Sunday the 15th. I forgot, it's not Saturday, it's Sunday. Anyway, I'm so excited for this week and this spread. Um, this, I'm using a Sticky Essentials kit called Christmas Spirit, and I'm pairing it with some silver foil. So these are the gorgeous full boxes. I especially love the Olaf one. I just love them all so much, the fireplace scene. And then you have the heart checklist, the small circle icons, your weekend payday, day off, your work labels, and some boxes. You have your little things, quarter boxes and half boxes. You have your headers and more boxes. I love that her kit comes with, or that her kits come with so many boxes. You have your small to-do list, your page slags, your movie marquee, your habit trackers, your um, appointment labels, your patterned washi, and some more boxes right there. And then you have your weekly trackers, your page flags, your gorgeous deco, and your large circle icons. You have your bottom washi, which I already put down, and I paired it with the silver with white bow simply gilded washi. And then there's an extra full box here. Oh, I didn't even plan out my full boxes this week. And then you have your full heart, full box heart checklist. And then you have the glitter the glitter headers and more boxes. I accidentally picked up a second one, but that's no problem. I'm trying. I want to pick up this kit again for next year. And then I have some circle icons from Sticky Essentials, some kiss cut icons, and then the glitter header overlays from her shop as well. Um, I don't think I'm going to use the extra full box. Although it is really cute. Yeah, I think I am. Oh, it's like a bath scene. Because that's the bath with the candles and you're eating Christmas cookies and watching Mean Girls. So yeah, I think I'll put that one down here. And I don't need the checklist. So we'll put those to the side. Um, I do want to say the past two videos I filmed, I had a really hard time... Uh, with my tripod, it kept falling over. Or no, the phone, my phone kept popping off the tripod. Is that, okay. No, I feel like that's too far over. And now it's not straight. All right, come on, we can do this. Put that one down. Let me see. Let me get my quote ones. Or not my quote ones. Um, I really think I'm gonna use. Hmm, they're all so cute. I don't know how to decide which one to use in the corner, or for the thankful thought. I think we'll go with the. No, I think we'll go with this one. And now maybe it'll be a little bit easier. I still don't think that's lined up. Alright, maybe now it is. Let's see. Okay, I think that's as good as we're going to get. Alright. So, all right, so for a Monday, we're going to do the cute little Santa cup with the hot chocolate. I'm always so, oh. I'm always so nervous laying boxes down because I'm always afraid they're not going to be straight. All right, so Tuesday, I think we will use the Christmas bucket list. I 
I really hope this kit stays in her shop for a while because I want to pick it up for next year. Um, and then, oh my gosh, look how cute that is. We'll use this one. I love this clip art. I love the colors. I just think it's so cute. And I love how that the name she, um, the name of the kit that she named it Christmas Spirit. And then I think we will do this one on Thursday. And we'll have a little cute Olaf on Friday. And then we'll have the double box on Saturday and Sunday. I'm like petrified that my camera is gonna, or that my phone's gonna pop off the tripod again. This little fireplace scene is so cute. If I can get the last full box off, there we go. All right. And this one. And now we will go in with the glitter headers and then the glitter header overlays. And I did get two questions. I put um, on my Instagram to leave me questions for my next plan with me. And Allie from Allie Joan Plans and Emma from Emma Plans um, left me some questions. All right, so I think we're gonna do it kind of want these two together but no I think we'll keep it like this so Allie from Allie Joan Plans asked how did your love for decorative planning start um I've always loved stickers and planners um we got a planner in middle school to keep track of like our homework assignments and stuff and then ever since then I've had a planner like in high school you would get them as well and then in college I would just use um like different planners like I would pick them up from like Target or like office or like Staples not Staples Office Max Office Depot because we don't have Staples where I live unfortunately um and I guess my love for decorative sticker planning started a couple years ago when I fell down the rabbit hole of Etsy. And I just love it. It's just so fun and it's my creative outlet. I'm not, um, like I have other hobbies, like I love to read and stuff, but I don't have any other like creative hobbies. So this is like my creative hobby and so I've been planning pretty much since middle school, um, but the decorative planning started a couple of years ago. My first, my first Erin Condren I got in 2011, and the first I want to say like 2011 to maybe like 2014-15, um, I didn't use stickers. Well, I use like some random stickers, but um, I mostly use colored markers and pens like I really loved using the paper mate flares and uh, the stab liners but then once I fell d down the rabbit hole of Etsy and stuff it <laughs> I haven't looked back and I really miss buying stickers and planner stuff I'm not working right now so I'm not able to afford it but Hopefully, I'm not working due to health issues, but hopefully my only wish this year is for, for 2020 is to is for my doctors to figure out a way to help me so that I can start working again because I really miss teaching as well as shopping. So thank you, Allie, for leaving me that, that uh, question. And then Emma of Emma Plans asked me my top three favorite movies. So my first favorite movie would be Now and Then. 
I love that movie so much. I remember the first time I saw it, I was sleeping over my sister's um, apartment and she rented that movie and I just love it. I think I watched it like two more times the next day. So yeah, I love that one. And it's also on Netflix now. So if you haven't seen it, I definitely recommend watching it. And then my second favorite movie would probably be 10 Things I Hate About You. I love that movie so much. And even though I own the DVD, anytime it's on TV, I watch it. And then my third one is actually a Christmas movie, but I just love it so much that it's highly ranked up there. And even though I've seen it like hundreds of times, I still laugh as hard as I, was, I did as I watched it the first time. Laughed as hard as I did. Yeah, I think that made sense. And that would be um, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. I just love that movie so much. So thank you, Emma, from Emma Plans for uh, asking me that question. I really do love when you guys leave me questions. And you don't just have to leave them on, on Instagram. I just do a question on there, um, like the question filter or the create a question filter. Um, but you can also leave them here if you have a question for me. It doesn't have to be planner related. It can be about life in general. Um, just... I like answering them because it gives me something to focus on instead of going off into tangents, which I have a habit of doing. I love this kit so much. I don't know if you noticed, but I finally stopped biting my nails. After I got the acrylics off that I had on for my friend's wedding, I was determined to stop biting my nails and so far, I've been successful. I also take like the hair, hair, skin and nail gummies. So, all right, now we can go in with the glitter header overlays. I got really quiet there, sorry. I just, I always get nervous when I put foil down because I'm always afraid I'm gonna mess it up. And you can't really mess up, afford mess ups with foil. These are so cute. doing much lately um actually I've been watching a lot of Christmas movies reading Christmas books and um, watching lots of YouTube videos I don't know if you saw but in my last no it wasn't when I was filming but during the last so like a week ago yesterday ooh, ooh, ooh. a week ago yesterday my computer stopped working and my stepdad couldn't fix it, so we actually had to take it in to get fixed. Um, they just said there was a lot of viruses on it. Um, but he said the only way that you can stop that from happening is to never go on the internet. So it wasn't like something that I did. This planner is so chunky now. Now that we only, after this week, we only have one week left in it. Well, after this week, not the week I'm filming. So I'm thankful to have my computer back.
Oh, that's cute. I like that. I had my first Christmas cover on. I did, I put the Oh What Fun one from Erin Condren on, and now I have the one that's, it's the most magical time of the year, or it's the most wonderful time of the year, not magical. Um, and then after that, I'll be using my Follow La 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 cover. I wish I, I wish she had um, a birthday cover on her website. That would be so cute. So what have you guys been up to? If you're watching this, what planner or planners are you using for 2020? I will be using an EC vertical again, like I have been for the past nine years. And I also wanna get like the petite planners, but I can't afford them right now. But maybe if I start working again sometime in the year, I'll get those. All right, we just have a couple more of these to put on. These are like the easiest um, overlays to put on. I don't know if like the paper is thicker. It feels like it is. It doesn't feel as um light as some other overlays I've used. And then after this, we will go in with the meal labels and then we'll start on the sidebar and then go into the day-to-day -day planning. how those are looking. Put those off to the side. Put the cap on my tweezers. And then we're gonna go in with our meal labels. Kind of bummed. I really wanted to go to New York for Christmas to be with my family, but it just didn't work out. After this video, I'm going to take a little break and watch some more YouTube videos. I do want to film two more videos, or at least one more video today, but possibly two while the house is quiet because I don't live alone. So when my parents are out, I like to film because I don't get as much background noise. Not that they're like noisy or anything, it's just... Also, my room, which is above the garage, doesn't have um, a door. So, like, you can hear, like, noises from downstairs more prominently. All right, and then we're on to the sidebar. I want to get uh, this week header. And then, where's the page? There we go. I think I'm going to use the green weekly tracker. Uh, yeah, green weekly tracker. I thought I said habit tracker, and I was like, no, that's definitely not a habit tracker. Okay, and then we're going to use this, and then we're going to put some deco. Obviously, since I used the full box there, I don't have as much room for deco as I normally do, so it will be splattered against, not splattered, it'll be spread against the top. Splattered, sounds like a murder scene. All right, so let's see. We are definitely gonna put Olaf over here. Actually, let me grab my tweezers. Ah. So we definitely want this cutie pie Olaf because he is on the other side. Ooh, that cupcake looks really good. 
I'm like obsessed with cupcakes. Like if you ever want to get on my good side, not that like, not that like I would be on my bad side, but like cupcakes and ice cream. Oh yeah. I think I actually want to put that up top right there. Okay. And then uh, let's see, we can put the shirt. This one says, wait, what does it say? I'm kind of a big deal. And it's the Grinch. That's so funny. Um, Like here, but this snowflake, but I think it's a little too big. Ooh, let's put the like poinsettia flower in there. There we go. Okay, let's fill up some up top. Mm. Oh my gosh, they have Christmas vacation on here. So funny. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Oh, I'm covering up the Y from Monday. Need to just scooch that up a pinch. There we go. Um, Christmas bucket list is there. We can do the snowflake. Um, this little cup of hot cocoa. Why are you not using your tweezers? They're in your other hand. <laughs> I'm talking to myself. I'm talking to myself, but you can hear me. Uh, let's see. Let's do... A lot of the deco is like movie scenes. No, I want to put that on the other side. Is Elf on this side? No, we can put Elf on this side. And then maybe this Grinch cup. I love this so much. It's so cute. Look how cute that cup is. Everything's so cute in this spread. Or this kit, not this spread. Um, I think we'll put this one over here since it's small. Again, I'm holding the tweezers and not using them. All right, and then the rest will go on this side. So, a miracle. I like Miracle on 34th Street, too. That's a good one. I love all Christmas movies. I tape all the Christmas movies, all the Hallmark movies, the Lifetime movies. Just, I love them all. And I have a pile of them over there that I want to watch as well. All right, so we will do the Christmas. Again, you're not using your tweezers, even though they're right there. And then we will do this cup over here. The movie is there. I might have to cut this so that it'll fit. Not that one, this one. Yeah, because that's definitely gonna go off the page, but I don't, I guess maybe I'll cut her, I'll cut her feet off, like here, because we do have the feet over here, and I don't wanna cut that little doggy off. So hopefully it'll fit. I don't wanna have to cut too much more down. But it's a big piece of deco. Maybe if I put it to like the side. <gasps> Will that work? Yes. Perfect. Okay. I love using all the deco in the kits because it just looks so cute. Okay. So now that that is done, we can go into the day by day planning. Oh, I had meant to use some of the five millimeter in my sidebar. Oh, well. And put that to the side. Um, okay, so Monday, all I have to mark is that it is two days until Christmas, and I have these town. Hey, buddy boy, my cat right there. Hi, buddy. I'm almost done. Okay. <laughs> he, I'm petting him right now. He's loving it. Were you just awake? You slept till almost twelve thirty. Silly boy. 
Alright, so for these, I don't know if I mentioned, I think I said these are wonton in a million countdowns. So I'm going to put that right there. And then the one over here. And then I have these Christmas Eve and Christmas Day stickers from Christy Ann Designs that I want to use. Okay. Um, so that's all for Monday. Tuesday, I want to mark that it is Christmas Eve. I think I'm just going to put that above this. Ooh, that's cute. Hi, Dave. I'm almost done, buddy. He wants to snuggle. Um, and then, oh, I wanted to mark that A Christmas Story is going to be live on TV, but I won't mark that. Bye, buddy. And then I also want to mark that it is one week until my birthday. I have these really cute countdowns from Caress Press. I know they don't really match with this kit because it's like pink and blue, but. And I'm just going to put that right, oops, center it maybe. There we go. So that is all for Tuesday. Wednesday, I want to mark that it is Christmas with this sticker. And then the only other thing I have to... Really, I don't have a lot to mark this week. It's basically a countdown to my birthday that I need to put in every day. And then some, like, blogs or a blog post I want to make and a TV series I want to start watching. So then we're going to put Christmas Day up there. And then six days until my birthday, we'll put it, we'll just keep it down here. I don't know what I'll put there. Maybe some Christmas stickers that I have. Oh yeah, let me pull out my Christmas chunk monk binder. My friend Jess sent these to me. These are the Christmas Emoji Sampler in the bright colorway. Um, I think we're going to use the... Um, we'll use this girl. She's cute. She cute. Well, they're all cute. Alright, that is all for the half week. Or the first half, not the half week. Um, and then for thir or Thursday, it's five days until my birthday. And then I want to put another Christmas sticker. And we'll put this one with the animals right there. But then I want to, I don't want to use all of these things, so... Put these back and get out another sheet. Let's see. Oh, we can use some of the scribble prints. Colors. Oh, here we go. Alright, so this is going to go over here. And then we're going to put Friday is... A blog link up it is the end of year favorites so I'm gonna go in with this green oh, we'll do it up here this green box and then I want a little computer icon there we go and we will write in that it is the blog link up. I totally put that book in. Um, and then the birthday countdown. Where'd that sheet go? Uh, I just had it. There we go. So we're going to put in four days. And then we're going to put in this cute sticker of a scribbler from Scribble Prints Co. with the tangled in the lights. And then... Saturday is just the countdown, three days until my birthday, and we will put in, I think this one is too big, uh, I like it, so we're going to mark it like that, even though it goes over, I really do like it, um, and then Sunday is a TV show that I want to start watching, 
I don't know what channel it's on. Um, I think it's either USA or um, Freeform. But I want to start taping that. So we're going to use this little label. And then I'm going to go in with my tool pen. I love using tool pens on my matte stickers. Um, so this is Blog Link Up. And then the TV series is called series is called Dare Me. It looks kind of interesting, so I want to check it out and see what it's all about. And then last but not least is the two days. And then we're gonna put this scribbler with the Santa Claus hat on. And now we're gonna flip it open. I really like how it's turning out so far. So the kit is Sticky Essentials. The glitter header overlays are Sticky Essentials as well as that circle icon. The wonton, these count Christmas countdowns are wonton in a million. The Christmas Eve and Christmas Day stickers are Christy Ann Designs. The birthday countdown are Caress Press. These are the Coffee Monsters Co. These are Scribble Prints Co. And this is Chrissy Ann Designs. And this washi is from Simply Gilded. So thank you guys for watching this video. As always, if you have any questions or comments or questions you want to ask me for my next plan with me, feel free to leave them in the comments. And thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.